Okay? This is going to happen when you're doing a cold reading. You're going to be at an audition one day, and they're going to like you, and they're going to say, I really like you, but I want you to read a different role. And they're going to say, here, here's a scene. Go outside, work on it. Come back in in 10 minutes when you're ready, and we're going to run it. And so you're going to go outside the lobby. You're not going to have time to memorize it. You're going to have to work on it the best you can. And what we don't want you to be doing is having your head in the page the whole time, right? So all I'm going to ask you to do is remember this for now. The only thing I'm asking you to do is I do not want you looking at your lines while the other actor is talking. I'll say that again. It makes sense. I'm asking you to not look at your lines when? When the other actor is talking. Which makes it really good because you can look at your lines while you're talking, which is kind of convenient. Mm -hmm. So you never have to worry again about not knowing your lines because you can look at your lines when you're talking. I just don't want you looking at your lines while he's talking. Now, why do you think that is? Because then you're just the page not connected. That's right. And everything that he's saying or doing needs to color the way you speak. So if your head is down here while he's talking, how is your reaction going to be honest? Mm -hmm. It won't be. You're going to be giving me what you think you should give instead of what it really is. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So let's try it again. And, and what you may have to do is you may have to have your thumb Hold the page with one hand, and the other, thing, the other hand is going to be going down the page kind of slowly with your thumb, okay? So that as you're talking, your head's going to be up here while he's talking, and you may not know where to go, but if your thumb is going down the page about as fast as you're talking, you'll know. Just go to my thumb, and it'll be approximately there. Do you follow me? All right? You ready? So you're going to be thinking to make sense of it, so you're going to probably want to hold it with one hand, and your thumb is going down the page with the other. And you're thinking to figure this out, is that correct? Yeah. And the only thing I need you to do is be theatrical, and I want you to be tough. I want you to be a balls out, tough lady. All right? So go ahead and kick his ass. You ready? And action. Yeah. Did you feel a little bit more like you had something to do? Mm -hmm. You just keep have to keep trying to make sense of what he's saying, how to handle it. And the, you know, the, the tougher, the more of a backbone you have, the more you get in his face, the better. Because you have such an innocence about you, the way you look, you can probably get away with stabbing a fork in his eye and the audience will still love you, okay? Because you just come off as a very likable person. So feel free to let him have it, okay? Um, and go ahead and get really, really theatrical. Was that a, Yes, no. you're on the right track. But don't be afraid to floof your hair, you know, and, and get really, like, theatrical, you know, no, it was, you know, it was, it was yes, exactly, overly dramatic, yeah. you know, be like a little bit of a diva, okay? <laughs>